Welcome to the last safe city on Earth, the only place the Traveler can still protect. It took centuries to build. Now, we're counting every day it stands. And this tower is where the Guardians live. What is up guys, Crafty here and we're back with the Destiny Beta. Say hi to the newest Guardian on the block. This is my character for the Hunter class. And it looks like we've got some mail. Let's see. Checking, checking, checking. Okay, it's just Bungie giving their thanks for testing the beta. Goodbye. And it looks like we need to meet up with the Vanguards in order to get some armor, I guess. Rewards for finding our way to the tower and becoming a new guardian you have questions so yeah every class has their sort of mentor within the tower and they're called the vanguard so we have our own vanguard the hunter vanguard hey what's the story kid and yeah it looks like he's given us some armor to start us off within the world of destiny and you can also see that you can come back and purchase additional items if you manage to acquire glimmer so you're which right. is the currency of destiny so yeah this is pretty much entry level i've still got a long way to go in order to build up my guardian and have him worthy of fighting within the crucible which is the competitive multiplayer element of destiny but we'll get there and this is the gunsmith this is who you come to if you want to buy any guns and it looks like he's giving us a free weapon to choose from i think i'm gonna go with the auto rifle they're all pretty much similar in terms of attack damage with us at Twilight Gap. Wiped pretty bad there. Not the gun's fault. And again, he's got various weapons as well of varying degrees of damaging Careful effect. Just gonna equip that as our primary weapon. Okay, now it looks like we're going to check on our ship. The tower is actually quite a large space. It's basically the social hub where you can meet up with other guardians and form fire teams in order to go out and do the campaign missions or strike missions. And it's basically the replacement for your traditional lobby system. Rescue medics selected. Wiping metadata and returning to Vanguard HQ. Very nice. Okay, got our jump ship. Any word from our request settlement debris fields? We're so close. I can Stand almost back. smell the air from the walls. Okay guys, welcome back. We're now in orbit and we're going to start the next mission. The next campaign mission, I should say. And for that we need to head to Earth and Old Russia once again. And this is the next mission, Restoration. And it looks like Tricked is joining us for this mission. I think he's already done these missions, but he wanted to jump in and show us the ropes, so to speak. The more the merrier. Let's go. There's so little left out here. We were lucky to even find this ship. A Guardian can't do much to protect the city with that one. But it needs a warp drive if we ever hope to fight beyond Earth. And that Cosmodrome is the only place I know where we might still find one. We survived the Fallen once. We can do it again. A Guardian ship was recently shot down here. 
If the fallen haven't gotten to it, there might be parts we can salvage. Yeah, so it looks like Tricked has chosen the Warlock class for his Guardian. And he's got some pretty sweet armor already. Okay, we've got another guy who's joined in, another hunter. And he's already got access to his Sparrow, which is the personal vehicle that every Guardian has access to. We haven't unlocked that, unfortunately, just yet, but we should be getting that very soon. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be making our way across the Cosmodrome and looking for a broken down ship in order to get a warp drive in order to enable us to travel across planets okay, so this is the ship and we just need to take these guys out before we can deploy our ghost and find the warp drive Just gonna see if I can snag these guys out. Got one down and this guy seems to be hiding behind the rock. Alright, so Trick took him out for us. The ship's avionics are completely catatonic, but I can call their last transmission. Yeah, so Tricked is already on level 4. They managed to restore an information hub here. Down in the tunnels below. We should check it out. So yeah, he's probably played through these missions already. He's, I think, two ranks above us. That would explain why he has much better armor. And he's got his double jump as well. I still haven't unlocked that yet. But we'll get there. We'll get in there. I feel like going on a stabbing frenzy, just taking these guys out. It's a lot more satisfying than shooting them from afar. jump to any planet or moon. Our only hope is where we found our ship. We have to go back. Oh great, so it looks like we're heading back to the location where we initially got our ship and we're probably going to run into those fallen again. Alright guys, back out in the open. Okay, since Trick knows what he's doing, we'll just follow him and get to the checkpoints wherever we need to go. He seems to have a clue about what's going on. Scanning for the warp drive. Bad news, it's already in fallen hands. I hope you're ready for this. Okay, so this area here is where respawning is restricted. If you do die, you're gonna have to start over again, the entire section. But if you do have a team member, that your fire team member that you're doing the mission with, as long as they stay, stay alive while the respawn countdown starts and goes through, you'll be able to respawn and not have to do the whole section over again. In the walls. But that countdown timer does go down really slow, it's like a 30 second timer. If your fire team member does die within that time, you're gonna have to start over again. 
Otherwise, your other team member can also come and revive you. Just to get you back onto the battlefield a bit quicker. So I'm trying to take this take this boss out. We need to deal with him a lot of damage in order to get him out of the picture. And at the same time we've got these other fallen dregs, I guess, that are making our life just a bit too difficult. There you go, tricked with the finishing blow. You just killed an Archon. This could cripple the Fallen. And we got a warp drive. I have to get you to the speaker. Nice, mission a success. There was a time when we were much more powerful. But that was long ago. Until it wakes and finds its voice, I am the one who speaks for the Traveler. You must have no end of questions, Guardian. In its dying breath, the Traveler created the ghosts to seek out those who can wield its light as a weapon. Guardians to protect us and do what the Traveler itself no longer can. What happened to it? I could tell you of the great battle centuries ago. How the Traveler was crippled. I could tell you of the power of the darkness, its ancient enemy. There are many tales told throughout the city to frighten children. Lately, those tales have stopped. Now, the children are frightened anyway. The darkness is coming back. We will not survive it this time. Its armies surround us. The Fallen are just the beginning. What can I do? You must push back the darkness. Guardians are fighting on Earth and beyond. Join them. Your ghost will guide you. I only hope he chose wisely. I did. I'm sure of it. We're in this together now. 